my most stressful moment was when I got married. <laughs> and then how I tackled it, then I started loving it. Okay, so it's not Tanav porn anymore. No, it's not Tanav porn anymore. I had my parents uh, passing, mm. my brother dying. That was really terrible because he was young. Plus, every time I'm about to do something and I realize that they'll find out that I'm a fraud. I don't like to, uh, to fail very much. I know that's not a very good thing because you learn from failure. I'm just bad at it. So, I make sure that I'm good at my craft. People so, ask oh, me, I see, how is it working it. with Sudhir sir? I'm Punjabi. The whole Punjab asked me, how was it working with Valusha? <laughs> <laughs> and I was telling me, scenes were very low. Then I was very bad. Hello everyone, welcome to E-Times and today I'm here to talk to the entire team of Tanav. It's a big team, so let's just get into that. Hi guys, how are you doing? Good, very good. Very good. Well, thank okay. you. Thank so, you the name of the show is Tanav. So, yeah. a little bit of fun on that. Uh, open question to all of you guys. What's been the most stressful situation of your lives and how have you guys dealt with it? So, starting with the lady in the house, Valusha. You know what? There are too many to even count. I've lost count. I've just realized that, you know, we go through stressful situations and then we just need to come out of it and um, you lose count. I've lost count for sure. Hmm. Yeah, not shy to say I've had many ups and downs. Right. Mana? My most stressful moment was when I got married. <laughs> <laughs> and then how I tackled it, then I started loving it. Okay. So it's all sorted now. <laughs> okay, so it's not Tanav porn anymore. No, it's not Tanav porn <laughs> okay. Uh, Sumit? Um, I think I was most stressed when my daughter was about to get born. So that's something, that's the time I remember most uh, vividly. Right. And of course, it was followed by a very exciting time. So I, I'm, I'm hoping that's, the, that's what happens with this Tanav as well. Okay. How old is not your daughter? <laughs> Sorry. Okay. <laughs> well, it is. Jet <laughs> can you delete it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what Panju mind does. <laughs> so how old is your daughter? She's 16. Oh, so this happened quite a, a while, while back. Yes. Yeah. Right. Shashank? I'll keep it serious. I think my mother's illness when I was a young boy, mm -hmm. I think that would be some of the most stressful. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And is that, is that like, I mean, when your parents are not well, that's probably the most sort of uncertain time for you, isn't oh, it? For sure. Of course, for any child. Right, right. So, these sir, you've had a long career, so I'm pretty sure there yeah, must be a lot there's of there's been enough. Too, too many ghosts, you know. Okay. Yeah, my parents uh, passing, mm -hmm. my brother dying, that was really terrible because he was young. Plus, every time I'm about to do something and I realize that I'm, they'll find out that I'm a fraud. <laughs> <laughs> every time you look at it, you know, and say, Are, abhi to baj gaya da, yaar, ab phir <laughs> you know, they'll discover that I, you know. Okay. So, that's the only time you start something is really stressful. Uh, and yet, you keep coming back. Yeah, yeah I mean, you're blessed. Something happens. The world, universe conspires, mm -hmm. you know. It's not up to you alone, no? It's but till the time to, anybody finds out he's a fraud. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, until the moment they find out. Yeah, that's, at some point they will. <laughs> we all have to walk away. <laughs> True. Um, Mana, I'm pretty sure you're not stressed about being the face of this show. I mean, you must be no, I'm pretty happy. I'm happy also. Secondly, my whole, how I have led my life is, the key word is surrender. Mm. I just work. I like to love people, I like to love my team, I like to listen to my people who have written it, who's directing it, and just give them 100%. Rest, in my hands, every person makes their life Taj Mahal. That's what So, true. I'm not stressed about it. Because, one more reason is because you're surrounded by great people. Hmm. You have like, uh, your backup, hai, applause, hai, or Samir Nair, hai, then you know that you have like, Sudhir Mishra there. So, the lot of ensemble cast, you have to deliver your own deliver. So, I don't think I'm going to think that my scene will be bad, the scene will be closed up, you know? <laughs> so, so, a lot of things, but I'm happy, I'm happy, I'm relaxed. Shashank, while I was watching this trailer, when you come across on screen as something, somebody very serious, is that also the real life persona or you're quite chill that way when you're not on screen? No, I don't think I'm anything like the character, hmm. but you bring yourself to every character. So, hmm. you know, every character is you. And of course, you're like that sometimes. I'm serious sometimes, sometimes I'm not. Okay. So that's a part of me which is serious and... Uh, uh, but no, I'm nothing like Junaid. 
I, I can't mm. understand. We even begin to understand what he's going through mm. uh, because uh, spending 20 years in Kashmir teaches you many other things about life, which I cannot possibly know. I was born in a privileged New Delhi, so lots to learn from the geography, the people, the conflict. Valusha, well, being in the middle of such an ensemble, there are so many actors. How does that make you feel? Is it is it good because it keeps you on your toes? I mean, how do you sort of react to such a situation? I mean, it's fantastic. Uh, for me, my first day on set was a scene with uh, Rajat Kapoor and Zareena Wahab and that was enough to intimidate you and then to top it all, uh, Sudhir Mishra sir. So, um, <laughs> uh, very nervous coming on set on that first day and uh, determined, uh, you know, to, to pull it off in a way where I, you know, no one looks at me as this is someone new to, new to her craft. Uh, so it makes you work that much harder and with me I am just somebody uh, who doesn't like failure. I don't like to, uh, to fail very much. I know that's not a very good thing because you learn from failure. Uh, but, and being a sportsman all my life um, while growing up, that is not something that um, you're supposed to fail and you're supposed to learn from it. Um, I'm just bad at it. So I make sure that I'm good at my craft. So it Correct me if I'm wrong, but I got the sort of feeling that your character is essentially the, the, the greatest sort of character in the show. So, is that a good thing when you're, when you're playing such a character, you, you're sort of guaranteed that the audience is going to give a reaction, good or bad. So, is that like half your do job done? Actually, uh, my perspective first of all is a little different. I feel most characters in this show are very fractured. Hmm. They, are, uh, they have their demons that they are dealing with. Um, in fact, I might add that uh, I find Umar's character most sorted in the sense that he's extremely clear about what he wants, mm -hmm. you know. So, uh, from his point of view, uh, he's not in the grey at all. He's okay. all white, mm -hmm. uh, you know, and, and he knows what he's doing, he knows why he's doing it. Um, uh, so, that, that to some extent makes it more challenging. Uh, as an actor because, uh, at least for me, because I myself am constantly r ridden with insecurity and doubts and I'm unsure, so I'm, I'm nothing like, uh, like how sure Omar is. So I had to somehow dig really deep within to be able to find um, this grey <laughs> that you're talking mm. about. So. You guys have now worked with Sudhir Mishra. I mean, how is he? Is he a taskmaster? Does he add stress to your lives when he's on the set? <laughs> or is he? So what? Thoda dekh. Yeah, all of us have something. Just just say. Just say. No man, I'm I'm very grateful that he's on this. He's able to sort of explain to me how a moment or a behavior plays out. Hmm. And for an, as an actor, you can't ask for anything more. Hmm. And especially in something which is as fragile as important to portray correctly, you have somebody who understands this with depth and mm. you're doing it keeping the fragility in mind and it, it's essential and I'm very grateful uh, that he's on this and of course apart from, you know, of course he's a taskmaster man, it's tough to make this stuff mm. but uh, it's tough days but it's been fun. Yeah. <laughs> I just love you. Guys. Oh <laughs> man, I, I am in love with Mr. Sudhir Mishra. No, 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 I am. No, no, no. no, no. <laughs> I joined, I joined <laughs> the boys actually a few days <laughs> later. Uh, they'd already been shooting and um, I remember I came to Kashmir and the first thing that everybody said, I was like, oh, so how is it working with uh, Sudhir sir? So they're like, oh my God, Shusha, no matter what you do, he's going to tell you to do it again and, and me don't know how to fail at anything. They are talking, I have left the room. In the sense, physically I'm there. I started muttering my dialogues and I'm thinking of how am I going to deliver? How is he not going to correct me? How is he? Oh, so I went on set, but he was such a delight to work with. Hmm. Absolutely. And I just, I didn't, I was a little disappointed that I wasn't so schooled by you. I just felt like I needed more schooling from him. I wanted more of that. You but know? I don't think he ever see does the, that. It's a difference. I don't think people so. ask oh, me see, how is it working with Sudhir sir. I'm Punjabi. The whole Punjab asked me oh. how was it working with Valusha. <laughs> <laughs> and I was telling me scenes bahut kam the. Fir bakwas. But I think I think the joy of working with Sudhir sir as an actor is uh, is that uh, that there's always something unexpected 
happening when you're on set. Yeah. And yeah. that is so liberating and so exciting from an actor's point of view mm. that you're want, you're, you, don't, you don't ever want to be away from the set. You want to be yeah. back there again. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of, you don't feel as alive. Mm. As you do right. when you're on his set. And of course, you also have those moments where Sudhir holds on to you and he's like, Girja, yeah, bhai, you're lying there with bones. I mean, yeah, I'm going to go here. So, I'll tell you. Yeah. Manusha, you're saying the dialogue, taste the meat. Taste the meat. It's just being made here raw. Taste the meat, taste the meat, taste the meat. Oh, mom. I didn't say anything for me. Nothing. I saw the shot and said, Shukar has done so much. The whole day is bad. Okay. Good. Sudhi, sir, in an ensemble, I mean, we can see the poster behind you, it just sort of never ends. So, in an ensemble, how many actors are too many? Or more the merrier? Well, it depends on the series. And actors are, you know, lovely people, you know. They give you their vulnerability and, you know, they expose themselves. When I came to the industry, there used to be this word called handling actors. Hmm. But you know, I mean, you work with actors, you don't handle them. So you work with Ompuri, and I work with the big boys, you know, with Shabana Azmi, this, that. So you work with Shabana differently, you work with Ompuri totally differently, you know. So I mean, every actor, is, and it's my job to sort of aid that particular method hmm. and not to impose mine. Hmm. Some actor may have this way, it's uh, and then you, you know, I mean, you, if you, I, I, what I've noticed is if, if you put a difficulty in front of the actor, mm. and because everything that we have done has been done before. Right. I mean, every actor has said, I love you, you know, you know, seen them. I mean, all scenes have been done, right? I mean, what is, so it's what you bring to it, what he brings to that scene is, you know, it's that originality or something. So if you put a difficulty in front of an actor, let's say, this scene to both bar aise ho chuka hai. थोड़ा इसमें ऐसा कुछ करा दो, है ना? थोड़ा अभी तो बहुत दुख की है, बहुत परेशानी का सीन है, लेकिन बच्चा हंस रहा है वहाँ पे। अब क्या करेंगे? ओके। ऐसा कुछ भी होता है, पर कुछ दुनिया, ज़िंदगी में तो ऐसा कुछ प्लान नहीं होता, है ना? So if you have, otherwise it's like you know close up person is upset, उस वो भी होता है, लेकिन there are all sorts of actors, and you know, some people need more, some people need less. Yes. Hmm. You know, you have to, you know, some something's working, right? So then you don't intrude. Hmm. Just, you know, and they've got it right, you know, so why should I, you know? I don't, you know, you don't have to play director, no? Hmm. <laughs> True. You have to True. direct. You have to direct. But you, there's not a performance, right? Hmm. Hmm. So I don't like, I mean, it's all, all sort of, it's great fun with these people. Okay. It's, it's a great gang, you know, and they all, they're not competing. So we're kind of sharing. अंदर से एक दूसरे के बारे में क्या feel करते मुझे नहीं मालूम। नहीं नहीं। आपने बोला ना great working with these people सबसे ज़्यादा इसको हो रहा है। मेरे बारे में बोल रहे हैं। तो you know I don't know the hate but you know they 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 kind of enjoy each other's company. So that's always a always a good plus. A plus here. Guys, have you all seen Sudhir sir's films? So can I can I shoot that question? Which is your favourite ones? I've seen a few. I'm going to take it. I've seen all of them. I mean, I think... I don't remember any of them. I've seen most of his films. The latest one, Serious Man, I really like. I loved Serious Man. Serious Man was lovely. I don't know what his latest work and I really like. Of course, I mean... And of course, all of his early work. I mean, I... I'm so glad people are not seeing Hazaro Koyal Chai. Because I'm kind of known by that film. I get upset by, you know... I mean, I, I get upset on behalf of my other films. One successful brother, no? No, what serious man? It's 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 a, it's a good film. I mean, I really enjoyed making. No, serious man was lovely. I mean, I remember watching it and. Not just Nawaz's performance, but the kind of subtext you brought into the storytelling was like, yeah. is phenomenal. Yeah, so, I don't know if we should talk about it that much, but yeah. I, I, I sort of, I, I, you know, it Tana. remade me as a filmmaker. I mean, there's I, so I, many serious men. There's something happened so to me when I made it by interacting with Manu Joseph's mind. So many mm -hmm. There was a that mind there. there. Right. So, so I was interacting with a movie. very, very great mind. <laughs> And I've always said this, that, that uh, I think most serious men I'm a better filmmaker. Oh, that's yeah. not bad. I mean, yeah, yeah. I mean at, at that juncture of fun. our career. It's great fun. And it's kind of blessing that you still allow around, you know, they still allow you to direct them, you know. 
फैंटेस्टिक दिस मीडियम यू नो अदरवाइज मोस्ट ऑफ माय फ्रेंड्स आर सेइंग बच्ची बड़ी हो गई है यार अब तो रिटायर हो जाए मोस्ट ऑफ देम मोर्निंग नो राइट हियर वी आर लुकिंग ऑन यू नो माय फ्रेंड शेखर कपूर इज एक्साइटेड अबाउट मेकिंग अ फिल्म राइट आई मीन सो इट्स इट्स फैंटेस्टिक दिस मीडियम नो बट व्हेन यू आर इन द क्रिएटिव स्पेस इट्स नेवर टू लेट राइट आई मीन I mean, sure. I mean, success. I'm pretty sure you guys I mean, all learn from Sunil Gavaskar one day it's a day <laughs> to walk out. Yeah, true. Only Gavaskar knew that. Knew that. True. True. There's one day you know, a day to working anymore. Hmm. There's the day to walk away. Hmm. Very few people know how to do that. But is that relevant to this or to the creative arts? Yeah, 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 yeah. One day, one day, one day, you have nothing new to. Okay. And you're just kind of repeating yourself, and you know. You're calling people, the producer. <laughs> Nobody's picking up the phone. Mm. <laughs> and that time, you have to realize that you know it's not only that they are at fault. It's just that you know it's, it's, it's a connection with the audience or whatever that you have lost or with that creative muse. Mm. And that day, I guess uh, all of them. Uh, I mean, will need to, and I so will I. You know, hopefully it won't ever come. Mm. Hopefully. Mm. Inshallah. Okay, final question, guys. Uh, since we're here to talk about Tanav, uh, let me just ask you it's again an open question. So, there are so many sort of levels of you know story and emotions that we could see in the trailer. So, what is it from these? You know, is it the is it going to be the political discourse? Is it going to be the emotions? Is it going to be the action? I mean, you have Kashmir over here. It's it's always a hotly debated topic. So, what is it about Tanav that is going to really sort of you know smack the audience with a surprise? If you ask me. Uh, in one word hmm. tanav is real the reality of emotions okay a reality of how anybody who's doing anything in kashmir is feeling hmm it's not like jingoism ki haan ji ye sahi hai galat hai his character is flawed i'm flawed so there are layers to it so we are showing a premise ek jagah जहाँ पर बहुत सारे किरदार हैं और वो किरदार फेल भी करते हैं खुश भी होते हैं उनकी लाइफ में कॉम्प्लेक्सिटीज़ भी हैं मेरी इच्छा है इसको पकड़ने की इसकी इच्छा है कि ना मुझे पकड़ सके मैं इसको मार दूँ बट दैट्स वॉट तनाव इज ऑल अबाउट नॉट नो नॉट पॉलिटिक्स दिस देर इज़ अूमन इमोशन गोइंग ऑन स्ट्रॉगली बिकॉज एज यू नो वट सुधीर सर डज इज ही ब्रिंग्स अ सब टेक्स टू इट सो आपको प्लेन स्टोरी दिखेगी and then when you will go to the third to fourth episode you'll understand the subtext of it hmm. anybody is going through a trauma or anything is happening there what he or she is going through that that is that is the brilliance of the now right now hmm. how much i've seen it hmm. so i think this is very beautiful to show both sides of a mind you know right there's, there's there's no there's no black there's no white sometimes gray sometimes green you know everybody's thinking in their own way hmm. so that's what the love is okay i think when you touch kashmir you cannot you cannot avoid or miss the politics of, of what course. it is hmm. but the beauty about the love is that it's not uh, harping on the politics but it's not shying away from it either hmm. it's rather showing the human story behind the politics of it right it's not it's not it's not about the uh, the evil that 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 surrounds us rather it's the the gray that mm. resides within us and therefore leads to the different kind of politics that happens it's the same thing that happens anywhere mm. and everywhere it's not it's not you can you can say that this particular conflict is of kashmir but but that same conflict is everywhere it's in our homes it's in our it's in our everyday society we may just choose to ignore it but it's everywhere right so it's a human story rather and uh, well usha you have one of the best lines in the trailer as well ab zor se bologe to hum you know hum dar jayenge kya yeah uh, well again like tanav is just talking about two sides of the same story hmm. uh, in my opinion no right no wrong um basic human emotion um a lot of passion um you know fighting for something that you believe in so who's to say you're right who's to say you're wrong uh, so i think a, a, a topic that's very delicately handled um you know and bringing it to the audience just to show two sides of of the same story but uh, you know just an insight into what it could be on the other side as well uh and the character i play which you will eventually see is 
also very difficult because uh, there is this woman who's who's whose belief is very strong in in what her husband believes in mm. and she supports that wholeheartedly uh, who's to say that she's so wrong mm. uh, you know it's because they it's it's you're fighting for something that you truly believe in with all your heart full passion Shashank anything to add oh you know our job is i think any artist job is to of course engage people but it's also to sort of uh, show or maybe mirror a certain reality and i think we've tried that mm. uh, to a greater degree and hopefully we've not done disservice to what is happening in Kashmir today and that's it we try to represent it without a bias and uh, trying to tell a story and hopefully we've been true to the story itself and uh, uh, that's all I can hope for. Cool. So Deep sir? Well hopefully first of all I hope it's a great tale, hmm. you enjoy seeing it and then you know I mean you then you also see various facets you don't make judgments, you don't reach easy solutions. Hmm. Hopefully it provokes questions, hmm. you know, and different questions in different minds, you know. And uh, you come up, uh, come out empathizing with m most things, you know. Of course, I mean, we are on one side, you know, I mean, nobody's on the side of terrorism. Hmm. But you are understanding people caught up in their various, hmm. you know, demon the various issues where they were born just the context of the geography right. it's not easy mm. right so i mean you hopefully come out with a deeper understanding of this particular conflict right while telling a tale which is human and has many other aspects and, and as i hindi mm. mein ras until there's not that ras in, in any tale so hopefully it's a great story right. and every great story mm. has all this, yeah. True. right, it's human right. and whatever and it leads to questions, True. not easy answers. True. All right, on that note, we shall end this and best of luck guys for the show. Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank, Thank, you. You. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you for joining us at E-Times. Bye-bye.